All right, let's say that you have some stuff committed already. For example, this smart env, this obsidian folder, etc. And they're committed and it's in the remote and you want to get rid of them. What do you do? All right, well, you're going to go to your dot get ignore and we can add them now. Obsidian. Smart env and I'll even do vault. Okay. Then what we want to do is remove them from the git cache, git rm r uh, cached, cached, and since we are in the just the the root of this project, we're going to say from here. So now you can see that that turned gray, that turned gray, and this is still green because if you run a git status, you'll see that it hasn't yet been added. Well, there's a lot of crap here, so it's kind of hard to see, but let's just do this, git add everything. All right, so we've, we run git rm-r dash dash cached and then a period for this directory. You can specify a different directory if you want to. Then we get add everything or the changes that we made. And now if we get commit, remove ignored files. If we get push, we should see them removed from the remote. So here's the remote. If I refresh, boom, they are now gone and ignored from the remote. So once again, that is git, uh, sorry, it is git rm-r cached and then where you want the directory uh, and all recursively all the directories to be included, then git add with whatever, you know, same thing, the files that you added or just everything and then get commit and obviously get push. Don't worry about that P, it's just a funny little thing I have as an autocomplete.